Okay, I'm out of the bed. So. So, it is a Monday, again, because I don't know if I'm going to put that last clip in, but just in case I don't, it is Monday, guys. The vlog is currently uploading. It might already be up. It might have already finished uploading or whatever, but yeah. So, I am officially back on YouTube. I am about to do start dinner and I'm literally just getting out of the bed and it is probably after 3 o'clock after 2, probably after 4 who knows but I'm just getting out of bed I'm just, I don't know today my body just was like no sis, you've been doing too much so I listened however my package came to me Be my ring light. I don't know, the box is way better than what I thought it would be. So I paid 39, so $4 for some change. I think like 42 with tax for for this one. Um, it's the, I think this one's 11 inches and not 10. I just watched a girl video and she had two ring lights. Now, why do you need two? You just know with how big the area you're in. I'm gonna be pretty up close. So, okay, so then it came with a box and another box. A lot of damn boxes. So, we're gonna assume that this is the tripod. I'm hoping that. I can use this tripod and the ring light, like without the ring light too, since the one I had is broken. Oh, that's cute. It comes with a little one. You can carry with your bag, Dawson bag, or whatever. So, it's definitely not a, um, I don't know, it's definitely not one that you would carry around with you, but I definitely can use it to prop you guys up throughout the house. But, that depends because... advertised that it came with a remote and stuff so okay so here is the ring light right okay so here's the catch I'm confused here's the phone part
shit. I'm loosening up stuff. I ain't supposed to be loosening up. Um. with the remote claim your prize please give me your order number you can't check your amazon always you have to find it please know that one person one account only can claim one time one set no matter how many sets you have bought please contact like a fellow team to claim your prize we were probably with you for hours and score this card is only six months on to original life so it's going to support good luck get away first prize get one more for free Second prize, get 30% off discount. Third prize, 20% off discount. And then you scratch the, the thing. Let's see. <gasps> Yo! And guess what? I got first prize. So I'm going to contact them because why not? You know? Business. Um, love us or have any problems? Contact us. Get three free months extended warranty. Never miss product giveaways. VIP membership. Guaranteed. Your guarantee card. You get three months replacement or a full refund. Any problems? Emails from team will be ready for you anytime. Okay, so I'm gonna save that. I'm going to definitely clean the new one. Uh, here's your remote. If I have a better, I'll be upset. It's off. Oh no, it came with one. Okay, so there's that. We'll see because it's saying that the remote is for the notes up until the nine, the iPhones up until the X and the X S Max. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. I mean, I have no problem actually pressing the button on my phone to start it, so I'm not really sure, but I'm gonna keep all my little parts because. I think I'm gonna have to I will tell you guys what we're having for dinner because I'm going to start cooking at some point. But we're having egg and rice. I'm going to have egg and rice and bacon. And I'm going to have egg rice. Egg and rice, bacon, and um, well, I'm going to stir fry my vegetables. So, the actual ring light part has this little remote thingy on it. This is for lighting. make it brighter the minus sign no the arrows are an exchange button switch between warm natural light and daylight the power button
and then the decrease delay USB situation okay but that wasn't really instruction it just told you what it was for and I'm gonna assume that to hook this up so then remade the ports I'm glad they when they give you the phones they give you the thing for the USB to go in to go into your phone so we shall see but what's this Keep ordering all this shit. That's probably, this is why I never got into stuff like this. Oh, cool! Is this a? Is this like a smaller tripod? Oh, that's cool. I think that's what this is. Let's see. Yeah, basically that is what this is. It's a smaller tripod. And the question is, how do you screw that shit? Um, I want to keep the box for that too. I want to do like two Um, let's see. There's another little booklet thing. So, because I was like, this is supposed to expand this one here, so it expands by unlocking. And then there's a third one, so that's cool if I want to do stand up stuff and I need the camera to come up. Hmm. You was smart, you was kind. But how do I attach? Okay, so just didn't even tell me how I'm supposed to attach the ring light. And before I claim a second one, I need to know these things. So, oh, okay. So, basically, you turn. So I don't know what this part attaches to. You definitely can loosen it. I don't know. I figured out one thing, but basically this when I, this was facing down, I turned it up and tightened it and then you screw your ring light into here right mm -hmm. open up the legs this will give me the, the shorter version and then I would where's my phone on I'm not sure I'm touching it. So what I'm going to do is try you guys out on the actual tripod. I don't want to put you guys on the power button. That would be stupid. Oh, that's so cool. So, Okay, it is definitely a much more professional setup. I honestly, honestly, I'm being honest, I wish that you could detach the actual ring light. I'm wondering if I can buy an attachment to attach the phone just to the tripod without having to actually 
take the ring light because I'm not trying to carry a ring light everywhere, you know? But I feel like there is a way to attach something here. I'll figure out. I'll play with it later. I do have you guys set up better, so at least I don't worry about you guys falling over. And like I said, this set was thirty nine about forty two dollars with shipping. I have Prime, so it wasn't a two day thing though. It wasn't two days. It did take about a week that I ordered that. Um, but I like that it came with the carrying case for the tripod. It just kind of sucks that I have to figure out an attachment for just the phone. I'm going to keep the box that the tripod came in. I recommend to clean the the free ones. I'm definitely gonna clean the free one. And that way when I I can put it up. Um, I have somewhere to put it and it'll be safe. But yeah, I'm gonna definitely tonight clean the free one. Why do I need two? Because that's just like
I'm talking to you because I feel like every time I open my mouth, she sits up. But I'm so excited, y'all. The lighting is so much better. So, I now can film content videos. At first, I panicked because... Remember when I unboxed it, I said the pamphlet said you, it, the, I guess the earliest or the latest model phone was the um, Note 9, but I have a 10 plus, so every time I would plug it into my phone, it would just flash, it wouldn't come on, so I was like, what the fuck, because I had already emailed them to tell them that uh, I had got the first place car so they could send me the second set for free. I'm like, dang, what I'm going to do with two that doesn't work? So then my thinking brain kicked in. And I'm like, what if I don't plug it into the wall? I mean, into my phone. What if I get a block, like a charging block? Because it's a USB in and plug it in like that, like the old Samsung blocks and the new ones. The new, I mean, I have an new block, but I have a piece, but I need my block to charge my phone. Um, and it works, y'all. I'm so excited. I'm still going to have to, I'm thinking, I'm going to have to get a, just a, because this one's not, this is going to be perfect for me to film, like, on my desk or whatever when I get ready to do content because now I can do content videos and this one should be it either sit low or you can expand it if y'all hear someone talking I'm watching over here so it's low but I wanted something like this like this is the perfect size to use to attach the phone just the phone portion and I could vlog like that in public instead of just holding my phone up. I mean, it doesn't really matter. I know, I know a lot of people are just hold just their camera. But it's, this little stick thing is convenient. So, I already unscrewed the, the phone piece from the ring light. And it doesn't just screw it on to here. Because this, you can call it. So, I don't know if I need to... Like, you know what this would have worked for? But mine's broke. Um, the part from the selfie stick. Or whatever. That would have been perfect to just screw on. I don't know what you would call it. So, I don't know. I'm going to figure it out. But it's 1227. All I had was some bacon. So, I'm definitely hungry. I still have it um that includes getting shots or like recently it's just been like quotes inspirational quotes or I, I do um, I'm a PR girl for a sticker shop so I'll promote her as long as something is posted and my business page remains active that's what I do Mondays Wednesdays Fridays and Sundays and then Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Tuesdays and Thursdays are actual like work days. So that means any research, any product development, any of that happens on Tuesdays and Thursdays. I give myself Saturdays off because that's my cleaning day. Maybe you speak, but you got all the way over.
driving between lanes. What are you doing? Are you fucking drunk? Y'all, if this man hit, hit me, I'm going to help him on. Get out and whoop his ass. drive truck like the truck drivers if you're tired call off find somebody else so now that i'm doing back to youtube i want to upload twice a week um want to, want to. so i want to do upload vlogs on mondays because the last day of the week for me is a sunday so i'm vlogging till sunday so i can edit like sunday night early early Monday morning and have it uploaded sometime on Monday I'm not going to give like a set time like vlogs come at 3pm because that's just not practical right now so um, that's that and then I want to do a content video so whether it's a makeup video or something along those lines I want to do that and I'm thinking I want to do it on I'm thinking I want to upload it on Thursdays either a Thursday or a Friday or whatever because let me see if I film the content on a Wednesday because that's a a day where I just upload to Instagram, my business Instagram doesn't require much. Then, yeah, or I could do it on a Thursday where I it's a work day for me. I get all work. See, I don't want to overdo it. I feel like I'm gonna film and then I'm gonna wanna not do anything afterwards or take you know, I don't know. So either Thursdays or Fridays, I'll figure it out. Is a content videos and again by content I mean uh, like makeup videos. I know y'all, I know y'all want those back. I want to do. I haven't seen anybody do this in the profit. I haven't been looking, but a shop my closet video, not a I'm selling stuff type shop my closet video, where I shop my own closet and put together pieces because I think that would be a good video. Considering we're in a pandemic, some people don't have a job. We about to get a new president. He about to shut the country down again. So people about to be again without jobs. And um, hell, just even if even if it wasn't a pandemic, times be hard. So um, you wanna, you know, you, you can like we buy people. I thought I.
just like literally just over two years because I think I broke my ankle probably in like October-ish, September, October-ish of 2018. And I hadn't really been able to wear heels like you're supposed to, like once you break your ankle, it's almost like you have to learn train an ankle again. So I wasn't wearing like baby heels. I was trying to just step back into my big girl shoes and my ankle would do this popping thing. So I was just like, fuck it. Or forget it. Sandals, tennis. I'm not a big tennis person. But I've been really been able to wear heels lately, so I've been buying them. So I think that would be fun. And now that I have the ring light and I'm getting the other one, um, the lady contacted me this morning, or she actually sent an email yesterday. I just didn't check it. And sent her all of my information. Information? Hmm. My information and stuff. So I should be getting that hopefully. Because the last one took about a week to come. So I'm hoping by the end of the week, if she sends it through Amazon, I don't know, we'll see, but I'm hoping to get that soon, and then I can film that particular video, but I think the content video for this week will probably be a makeup video. So I got my food, let's see. They smell hot. I got you some french fries, Carly. I am still uncooked, but I got you some french fries. So, I'm excited because these are supposed to be like <laughs> crazy, crazy hot. better than I actually anticipated. I just left my doctor's appointment. The reason why I'm not taking my mask off is because Walmart's like right there and I'm just going to leave the mask on until I need to go in there to get my daughter some teeth and medicine and stuff and to find my son a magic snake and to get his glasses or a birthday gift. However, and hopefully I don't see that no more, you know? But um so the first bit of good news no. mm -hmm. the first bit of good news is he gave me back the periactin like this is a new doctor so um i was kind of concerned because i was like he's probably gonna stay with your height you don't need any more weight on but he didn't um so, I'm going to, dang, I got my phone, I am hungry. And I will get some Subway, but Subway, after working at Subway, don't nobody make a sandwich like me, so I don't like it. But, he, um, he's, he gave me back a Periac, which I'll pick up when I leave out of Walmart. Uh, what else? So I like this doctor. He is an older guy. Um, however, he really took everything I said serious and he heard everything. So remember I was saying I've been on the hunt for a cardiologist. If you don't know with my last doctor, the two table test results weren't even looked at or, um, and stuff like that. But 
when when he went in the system, like even though they're different households, I'm guessing you can just like pull up a person's history. He was like, I don't even see that you ever even had a tilt table test done, um, stuff like that. So he, I have so many freaking tests that he wants done and whatnot, but. I'm not upset about it because I'm going to see a cardiologist. He also wants me to have a scan of my brain. Like, he's so thorough. He's checking everything. Um, oh, wow. He's, he's checking everything. Like, everything. Yeah, he... I'm... Y'all, I'm so so pleased i'm parked damn it into the, the parking lot with all these people in walmart so i'm like really 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 happy about that um i'm excited like because i'm i feel like with oh god all the weed coming out that car i feel like i'm gonna get answers this time which is what i really really wanted because my best friend was talking, it was like, with my heart doing this, the crap it's doing, and whatnot, it would just be a tragedy. I go to bed one night and don't wake up, or I pass out somewhere, and you know, people around me don't know what's going on. So, yeah, um, I'm gonna talk to the rest, tell y'all what else he said when I get back in the car, because I'm not about to vlog in this Walmart because it's nigga real. Good morning, y'all. So it is Thursday, and I'm not guessing about what day it is because my sweet girl made eight months today. But I wasn't home yesterday. I want to sit y'all somewhere higher. Let's see if I open. Trying to open this window. Well, that works so um the the footage for yesterday wasn't really long after i left the doctor i was by my family and got some really good news my brother's getting married <laughs> y'all i've been smiling about that since like they announced it like i'm so excited for him like if you know like y'all don't know but my brother has been through some stuff in the past few years or whatever so i'm so excited for him and he's marrying the girl we all wanted him to marry so yes congratulations are for my brother anywho i didn't get a chance to cook yesterday so i'm gonna cook today i'm gonna do the turkey wings i did look up this recipe on youtube because i've never cooked turkey wings growing up my mom did but I'm just not the biggest fan of turkey wings. I don't know what it is. I don't know. I, I think maybe because the meat's tougher than... I don't know. It's just... Mm. But you know how you get into a cooking rut and you're just tired of cooking the same old, same old. And my son doesn't eat meat. So it's like... He'll do spaghetti and meat sauce. He, does, he hasn't processed that. That's me. Plus, he's never seen me actually cook the, the ground meat down. So, I think that's what keeps him eating that. He'll do a burger. Um, He'll do nuggets. He's just started eating nuggets again. But he nothing with a bone or anything. So, it's kind of hard to cook for him. He cook for him. He'll do bacon. He won't do like... Like, if I do beans, he won't eat the meat out of the beans. So, he wants gravy and rice. But I'm not going to just make a gravy. You know, um, I need substance. Plus, I'm back on the pills, so appetite is like here now. I just took the one. He has me on one a day, so instead of taking it at bedtime, which, like I told y'all, I feel like he um, he gave me the. I think they came and pressure washed our doors today, but he gave it to told me to take it at bedtime because it's supposed to make you drowsy but i know how it works for me so i'm okay i am going to take some allergy medicine a little later because baby allergies is doing what they want to do 
simply because I walked across, I know I'm not supposed to be walking in grass, but I walked across the grass last night in my flip flops. I don't know if I stepped in the amp or if I got bit by a mosquito, but I'm allergic to insect venom and every my body just itches. So yeah, it is like around 12, maybe 11 or 12. So I had me some wine. I haven't had wine in a few days. So my turkey wings are, I'm gonna get them out of the sink. I'm gonna do them in this size Pyrex dish because it's only, um, I get my turkey wings from the meat market and I'll show you guys when I get back to it, but when you get them from the meat market, I guess uh, when you get a meat special or whatever, they cut them up for you. So they're cut down into smaller pieces which I actually like. It's a lot of meat on these. Mm. Okay, so what she did was, so the, some of the season she, seasonings that she used, I don't have, but there's an, a whole array. I'm gonna show you guys. So starting over here, you have garlic powder, onion powder. She used black pepper, but I'm not a big fan of black pepper, paprika. She used like a garlic and herb thing, but I had this. She used like an all purple. No, she used a, some something was in this area. So I grabbed adobo, red pepper flakes. She used all purpose. I have total. She used a little bit of salt, a little oil, some butter, um, some parsley, a little bit of water, and she chopped up an onion. I used all my onions. Thank goodness. Or whatever we will get groceries on Sunday and we're gonna do a pickup but I'm gonna use the chopped seasoning because it's so much easy I've already I had already started um, and then I had to take a break cuz and come back and regroup and try this again I had to take some medicine so this garlic powder um, in here and then there's onion powder what I was saying was she said that people ask, oh, and my oven is preheated to 375. Asked her how much seasoning you use, and she just was like enough to cover it. You are gonna basically dry rub these. This is my ground white pepper. She used black pepper, but to me, ground white pepper has way more flavor. Um, paprika. She used a smoke. She used regular paprika and smoke paprika, but I don't actually have any smoke paprika right now, so that's not gonna happen. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. The paprika is more so for the color. She was like, if you have to at some point go in and add some more once you go to rubbing, you can. Um, I'm using garlic pepper. She used garlic and herb, but I'm going with this. Um, then she used uh, something after that. I'll link her video down below. Um, I'm going to go in with adobo just a little bit because she did say the ones that have like your seasons with salt, you don't need to overdo it because they have salt in them. Um, she used a little bit of crushed red pepper flakes. She said don't go heavy because yeah but it's me. I like a little heat. She used all-purpose seasoning, but I have this um, total seasoning. Um, salt. I'm using a pink Himalayan salt. I know for a fact. Okay, I'm not going to say I know for a fact you don't need a lot of this. Simply because when I did my vegetables, um, I could use way more salt. Then she poured on a little oil. This is all I have left to kind of help spread that or whatever. Not a lot, just a little. That's them seasoned. Then she took and she added some butter. Yeah, because I took everything out in the oil. I lined it up in her oil. So, um, 
y'all let me know i heard that butter in a tub isn't real butter that it's considered um margarine what the fuck is the difference between margarine and butter whatever but it was like real butter you know real butter because it's thick it's in, it comes in the sticks i don't buy stick butter i feel like you spend more money on butter that way right? six i don't know what i didn't buy spoons and forks but whatever so she put a little butter right Y'all see me doing this because I don't want to touch the butter. I'm thinking that's enough, you know? She didn't like overdo it with the butter. So there's the butter. Then she put some parsley, right? Like I said, my oven is preheated to 375. She said you could do it on 400, depending on how much time you have. You just have to watch to make sure it doesn't burn. But I'm gonna go with 375 because I'm wanting people to get upstairs and get lazy. So we have our parsley. Then she added some water, not to cover it. You don't. She said you don't want to. Um. wash away the seasonings from the top of the, the turkey wings so I've added about that much water right that should be enough anyway she used a chopped onion she chopped up an onion I don't have an onion I used it the other day and then I was like I'm just gonna buy some chopped seasoning because she chopped up a medium onion or whatever so I'm really like just eyeballing this I do know that when it comes to making stuff that's going to involve a gravy you should definitely probably go heavy I mean it depends on you if you don't like onions they're pressure washing the doors they have to be um I mean, if you don't really like onion, then I don't know what to tell you, but a lot of dishes that involve you cutting up onion or using an onion or whatever, there's a reason for that amount of onion. And if you if you skimp on the onion, I feel it the dish is trash. So she covered it with foil or whatever. Now, mind y'all, I never, ever cover things in foil because... I feel like it takes forever to cook. And I'm impatient. But we're gonna go her way, you know. And this is what I like to use use to make a gravy. So kitchen bouquet. works we'll see however i'm headed to my best friend's house um we were at my house but then she mentioned she was cooking steak and something else i even eat steak but i want it and that's because i'm taking the pills now so i want to eat everything i see so i'm like sis let's eat it we're coming i did put a little in my hair a little curl but not like a tight curl i don't really care for that really vibe -va boom look unless i'm like really getting dressed up to go somewhere and i'm not so like just a little tight like the little messy wave look works for me and i did spray it with some uh 
so today is Sunday. I don't, I don't know. Yeah, today is Sunday. So I didn't, did I vlog yesterday? But like, I caught a few glimpses or a few things, but I didn't really vlog yesterday either. And I'm apologizing to y'all now because I didn't film the content video. I really didn't. I'm just, I ain't had the time. Um, I'm surprised that I'm even able to set up my first half of the week in my planner um, with my daughter being awake because sis don't be letting you get nothing done. So, um, we did a Walmart pickup. I'm going to show y'all what I got today. And then, of course, you know, well, and then it's other stuff we have to get, but it was just some stuff they didn't have, apparently. So... I got hot dog buns because tonight's dinner is tacos. I mean, tacos, ham, hamburgers, hot dogs. Because I honestly just don't want to cook. cook. I got some lemons for crab cakes. I got another bag of parboiled rice. I um. I like I like white rice too. Like I'll like regular rice. I don't mind cooking it, but pour boil is easier. I got two of these because I know for a fact if I'm not really hungry for bread, um, this is a good substitution. During my pregnancy, I had lost so much weight, y'all, and. I mean, I'm still a little small. Well, I'm not skinny, but I'm not what I used to be. And during my pregnancy, I remember that this was something they recommended for me to put the weight on. And I had gained like 10 pounds in a two-week time span. So, between my pills, my appetite increasing, which I did good. I've already had two meals today. This could be my in-between meal snack. And I could also probably snack on these like I always look for something to eat in the middle of the night if I put a pack or two by my bed then that's something for me to eat then um I have another thing of chopped cheese I, mean, I already have one but you can never have too much a small thing of mayo which is for pancakes then we got I've never seen this, but chili um, for hot dogs, for canes, we've got my sriracha oil, which I like to use on veggies, along with my hot chili oil. I got some more olive oil because I used the rest of it when I cooked oh the jambalaya yesterday. This is for my son. It's sweet style Thai style sweet chili sauce. I'm gonna have to text her and tell her because she's gonna need more mod sticks, my recipe. Um some actual onion. And here's the hot dogs. And here's the crab meat. This one was free because they had sent um, my best friend an email saying that they didn't have the lump crab, so we didn't get it. And they just put this in there anyway. So I'm probably gonna just mix this with the lump crab when I get some. So okay, y'all. So this is gonna be the end of the vlog because I'm not doing anything else um for the rest of the night. The hot dogs uh, the hot dogs are done. We ate. It's almost 7 30 and my daughter's bedtime is eight, so that means lights are about to go out real soon. Or whatever. I need to buy a book light because I wanna read, but um yeah, so 
Like I said, this is the end. I am, y'all, I'm tired. I'm about to take some more. I probably should from the Benadryl. I'm about to take a couple more because I'm still not feeling much better from the taking the four earlier. I'm going to fall, guys. So, I'm going to go ahead and edit this so it can be up for you guys tomorrow because I do want, even though I can't be, I haven't figured out this whole content video situation I know for a fact vlogs will go up vlogs will go up on Monday so yeah I will see you guys y'all see I fixed my point huh but anyway I'll see you guys in the next vlog